Good Wednesday to you. It is July 8th, 2020, and majority of the western slope today under, back under, I should say, red flag warnings this afternoon. That means we've already achieved the very dry conditions. Now with the wind coming at us from the southwest, the wind criteria has to be met. 25 mile per hour minimum wind speeds plus a sustained measurement of several minutes at that speed. So we're going to do it again this afternoon. Wind gusts today, just like yesterday, should hit 35 to 45 mile per hour zones. Outside of those uh, brief isolated gusts, you should feel the wind speed between 15 and 25 miles per hour. Now, yesterday at Grand Junction, we could not get past the 40 mile per hour gust zone. Montrose could not get past the 45 mile per hour gust zone. So we're going to look to do the same thing again today. We have a ridge of high pressure off to the southwest. That's going to build in through the end of the week. So as it gets closer to our area, we will let up on the winds on Thursday. But still, we're going to be a breezy for Thursday. We just may not be under a red flag warning. However, very dry conditions in place, folks. This is a cautionary statement. Please be careful with open flames and anything that could spark. And in addition to that, with the heat we're going to experience, now, yesterday, Grand Junction only hit 99 degrees. That would have been our third 100 degree day. Now, I don't know about you, but I have a feeling if you look at the extended forecast, there might be a third, possibly a fourth 100 degree day in our immediate forecast. As the high pressure builds in this weekend, we get hotter. Also, our mountain zones get a little bit stormier, so we could be looking at some pop and drop storms drifting over the valleys. That'll be a slight chance of showers at best. Near record temperatures. Montrose this weekend, upper 90s. This afternoon, middle 90s. And we do look to the middle of next week for a weather pattern shift.